So here's a quick problem, um, pretty easy using two things that you know, you could calculate it two ways. Um, how far from the concave mirror? So first we'll just draw a picture. Draw a picture, a concave mirror, mirror. Remember it's like a, um, like a cave. We'll draw our optical axis. There we go. Try to redraw that. Uh, we have a radius is, so we'll say, okay, this is our curvature. And so see, uh, the radius is 23 centimeters. And we have an object place, uh, where, where must an object be placed if its image is to be at infinity? So um, we could look at the, at the equations. So remember these equations right here, uh, the equ um, that first equation. So let's see back. So we can say one over di plus one over d zero is equal to one over f. So if we we want to figure out where we need to put our image, so what is these di? Um, we want di to be uh, at infinity. So if we want this to be at infinity, remember one over infinity is equal to zero. So if this becomes zero, then we know that di has to equal df. I'm sorry, d zero, do has to equal d has to equal f, right? So what we've done by saying the object, the image is at infinity, then this goes away, and now I can just set the denominators equal, and so this would be our answer. Right, and so D then would be equal to a uh, half R over two, because that's our focal distance, right? So um, R is equal to F over two, sorry, F is equal to R over two. It's not, so I can erase this. F is equal to R over two, and we want to place it at F. So we would just place our object right here, and that's going to equal 11.5 centimeters.